If you are looking for additional rules to put in your curator system to help you with a particular type of detection, one way is to go into the App Exchange, where all there are all these custom extensions also called are also named as apps. And you know the problem is that there are way too many and they keep on growing, so it's not easy to find what you want. If, if you all you are looking, it's not for a package but a specific set of rules. And then when you find the package, you need to go into the documentation of it and see, okay, yeah, the five custom rules that are in here, but then you need to go into the documentation to actually see the details of those particular rules and it's uh, there is a better way. So if you have the use case manager, and I have done several videos on this remarkable app, and, uh, and if you don't, you should. For, not for this season, for very many others, tuning and, and, and if you want to deal with your rules, this is the way to go. And this is another example. So let's say I'm here in the use case manager. And I have here, you know, in my system, I have 100, 818 rules. And let's say that I'm looking for stuff that uh, has to do with phishing, right? Because I want to improve my rules on phishing. So I can look here, I click in here and say, well, I want to do a regex search for anything in the rules name that has the word phishing. And if I just put that only that search criteria here, I go ahead and, and out, of, out of the 818 rules, 12 of them has to do with fishing, but these are the ones I have, and I can see what I have in here, but this is not what I'm looking for. I want to see what else can I add. Well, if I go down here, there is this section, this is content extension attributes, and content extension is an, another name for apps, right? And if I say, well, give me, including this search for rules that have the name phishing, anyone that is not install. So I have 12 right now. If I apply that particular filter, how many more do I get? I get 14. There are two more. Well, if I quickly want to know which are the two more, I say, well, select this additional checkbook and say, you know, show me only those, those new. And uh, here they are. They are not installed. Therefore, you don't see them enabled here. You don't see the switch here enabled. But in which package are those? Well, it's actually very easy because I can modify my columns in here. Let me scroll down and there's one of the multiple things that I can put is show me what is the name of the extension that has that package. And when I do that, I see that I have uh, in here the content extension name is IBN Phishing and Email Content Extension. It's actually those two rules are part of the same package. Okay. Now I can go into, I can actually copy this and go into the App Exchange again, but now I'm searching precisely for this specific package. And here it is. And here are the rules. So by me installing that, notice that there are 30 rules in the uh, so by me installing this package, I'm going to get those two rules that are listed here. So again, keep in mind that you can also do a search. Let's say that you, have a, you are weak in a particular MITRE uh, technique that you want to enhance and find rules for it. Again, you can actually do the search instead of looking for phishing in here. You can look for that specific tactic, find whatever is not installed, and then add it to your package. A short video, just a quick tip in case that you were not aware that the use case manager app has this way of searching for packages that are not currently installed in your system.